Rutgers takes the series versus Charleston Southern and proves to eight and two. Let's go. Welcome to the channel where I'm talking all things Philadelphia Eagles. New York Yankees, New Jersey Devils, and Rutgers Scarlet Knights. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Hi, Rutgers fans. What's going on? Travis Halonix here talking Rutgers baseball. The series win over Charleston Southern down in Charleston, South Carolina this weekend. Huge, massive Scarlet's now in all three series so far this season. Now sit at 8-2 and two after 10 games this 2024 season. Awesome. Friday got rained down to a doubleheader. Yesterday, Saturday, split it. Tough 11-8 loss in game one. Bounced back strongly in a great way. 9-1 win in game two. Today, 9-7. W came back down. 3-0 went up 6-3. Game was tied 7-7. Ninth inning record scored two. And then it shut it down by Joey D coming in. Two innings, six Ks. Unbelievable. We'll get into all three games. Recap them all. Go through the box score. Start with game one. As I mentioned, it was Saturday. Started off with a 130 first pitch. 11-8, uh, as I mentioned, Charleston Southern got the W. Rutgers scored five in the first inning. Charleston Southern came back at three in the first spot in, bottom of their half of the first inning. They got another one in the second. Rutgers scored two in the third. Charleston Southern, another run in the third, fourth, three in the fifth. And then another one in the seventh and eighth. And route to the eight to one win. It's a tough one. Um, Christian Capola has been great so far last year. First couple starts this year. Not so good. Uh, this weekend, three and a third, nine hits, six runs, six earned, two walks, six Ks. Jake Marshall has come in for him, I believe, both or every game so far he's pitched. Uh, this season, he came in through four and two thirds, eight hits, eight hits, five runs, three of them earned, two walk, two walks, six Ks. So, not their best outings. Obviously, they hit around a bit, but um, it's a tough one. Rutgers offensively, uh, they, we had 10 hits, three errors committed by us. R.J. Johnson Jr. was two for four. Trevor Cohen, two for four. Josh Carter Grower, two for four. Cam Love, two for four. R.J. Johnson Jr., two RBIs. Carter Grower, two RBIs. Same thing for Cam Love. And uh, Hugh Pickney. And uh, Carter Grower doubled at the middle in the first. Cam Love doubled. In the first, sitting there, records. R.J. Johnson, dub Johnson Jr. doubled in the third. Hugh Pickney, a fly out. Uh, in the fourth, scored records runs there. So, again, tough loss. Uh, we're up on uh, just a uh, high scoring affair. Just didn't have it in that game. It's 17 hits for Charleston Southern. But as I mentioned, so tough loss game one, you know, after it got rained out Friday, doubleheader Saturday, lose game one. But then they bounce back greatly, as I mentioned, on, on Saturday. I mean, on game two on Saturday, 9-1 uh, to one win. 9-1 to one win. And it was all Justin Sanibaldi. Normally our Saturday, game two of the series starter this year, to that, uh, this week, obviously game two on Saturday. Eight innings, eight innings, four hits, one run, one earned run, no walks, 11 strikeouts. Just dominant, stellar performance for Justin Sanibaldi. Sam Portner came in, pitched ninth inning, scoreless with a strikeout. Great job, tremendous job, Justin, Justin Sinabaldi. For Rutgers, nine hits, nine runs, three in the third, three in the fourth, and three runs in the seventh inning. Crota Grower singled in third. Drocher singled. Jordan Sweeney singled, knocking in three runs there. In the fourth inning, Jackson, uh, the Tilly singled. Volpe grounded out, scored, knocking in a run. Cam Love with the sack fly. Seventh inning, Crota Grower single. Volpe fly out, and the Tilly um, out. Uh, but score Cody Grower on the play there. And uh, leading wise, uh, Josh Cody Grower in three for four. A couple RBIs. Jackson Tilly two for four. So, yeah, all around good stuff in that game. Even the series up, splitting the double header, which set up um, game three to series. Rubber, rubber match, rubber game. Uh, and it was huge coming in. It was 11 o'clock a.m. first pitch uh, Sunday morning. And um, 9 7 the final score. Rutgers takes it. Trying to bring up the box score here. Do that in a second. Charleston Southern scored three runs in the first inning. They're all unearned. Rutgers came back with a run in the third. Then five runs in the fourth inning. Take the lead 6 3. Charleston Southern got one back in the bottom of the fifth inning. Home half. And two in the seventh. Um, 
Go ahead, I believe, 7-6. Rutgers and that run an eighth inning. Uh, Charleston Southern a run in the eighth inning as well. Or um, the two run, runs in the seventh inning for Charleston Southern. Tied the game up six after seven. Rutgers run in the eighth. Charleston Southern run in the uh, eighth inning. The Bucks. So 7-7 seven, seven after eight. And Rutgers two in the ninth. And then uh, shut it down. Joey D. Joey D. Who came in. 7-7 seven, seven ball game. Go ahead and run on second base in that eighth inning. Struck out the side. Three strikeouts. Came back out there now. The two run lead in the ninth inning. Struck out the side. Six strikeouts of two inning. Joey D. Joey DiChiaro. Been amazing. Been amazing coming over. Grad transfer from Old Dominion. Awesome stuff. The left-hander Joey D. 15 hits for the Scarlet Knights. 11 for the, the Bucks. And, um, scoring wise for Rutgers. Josh Carter Grauer singled in the third inning. Jordan Sweeney singled in the fourth. Cam Love singled. Arthur Johnson Jr. singled. Uh, Tony, Mar Tony San Maria singled. Josh Carter Grauer singled all in that fourth inning. Score those five big runs. And the uh, eighth inning, Cam Love is single uh, for Rutgers' seventh run. And the ninth inning, 7-7 seven, seven ball game, Trevor Cohen to go ahead. Single, Pete DeRocher adds in the insurance row with a nice single himself. And there's a scoring box score. Leader, RJ Johnson Jr., two for four in RBI. Josh Crotogauer, three for five. A couple RBIs in there. Pete DeRocher, two for four. Cam Love, two for three. All good stuff. Good stuff. Pitching wise, Zach K got the start. Four innings, five hits, three runs. None of them were earned. No walks, two strikeouts. A pretty good outing for Zach K. I believe the freshman, Joe Massa, two and two thirds in relief. Four hits, three runs. Four strikeouts, no walks. Sonny Fauci, a third inning. A couple hits, a run. And then, as I mentioned, Joey D. Joey DiChiaro comes in. Two innings pitch. No hits, no runs, no walks, and six strikeouts, shutting it down and getting securing Rutgers the W in the game, a series W, and the Scarlet Knights improved to eight and two on this young season. Ten games in now, eight and two, won every weekend series so far. Awesome, awesome. Winthrop, uh, what Old Dominion, Charleston Southern, and uh, massive, massive. Now we got the home opener coming up Tuesday. Scattaway at Bait Field, the host Wagner, three o'clock first pitch. Let's go, let's go. Love to see if you enjoyed the weekend series win for Rutgers. Eight and two starting now. Enjoy the video here. Like it up, smash the like button, drop your comments down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Have a good one. Let's go, Rutgers.